There's got to be lots to like about this game. What are the things that need to be improved on for you guys to get over the hump here? Uh, I think it's just a, a defensive consistency and the way that we finish our games. Because uh, I think we lost like probably like three games, probably similar first half. We were playing really well. And then fourth quarter, we just can't close it out. So I think we've got to find a way to uh, play better defense at the end of the game. First half, the execution is there. Yeah. What's missing in the second half and down the stretch of some of these games that we've seen? Tempo. We, I feel like... You know, we create our own tempo in the first half, the second half, we come out sluggish and that's where they run off with the lead, so. What was Winnipeg doing well in that stretch of the game? Pressure. Uh, they put a lot of pressure on our front uh, back of guards. Um, they ran a press that basically made us turn over the ball a lot, actually, and uh, yeah, it was just pressure. If you could sum up the first half of the season, how would you define it? Uh, I would say a learning process. Because we have a fresh new group of guys, so I think we've used that whole semester to learn each other and learn what's our flaws and what we're good at, and then hopefully we can take what we've learned and translate it into the next uh, semester. How huge are these back-to-back -back wins over the Bobcats going into the holiday break? Uh, it's been pretty big because uh, we, we've been on a losing streak, so uh, we need to come back and get these two wins. Yeah. What impressed you the most about your team's rally in that second half, and in particular the fourth quarter? Uh, just everyone was involved. Our bench was invo involved. Uh, the guys on the floor were involved. Um, yeah, we just had big time energy.